here this is another battle from Arm Fro versus Bring the Pain of Smog and Forms. And we decided to do a OU standard battle, so I used my usual OU team, so I sent out my Gary twenty five. Um, he goes in his I douse blacks. I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but I go for a close combat here, and I didn't think I'd do this much damage during, during the lightest. I don't know if he has low defense EVs or something, but I'm actually faster than him too because I'm jolly and I'm speed oriented too, and so he must be a special defense book on. So I take it out with two hits. He sends out his blue chrome, which is kind of ironic because I have a black chrome. But he, I go into my Degoro, he goes for a bullet punch. Um, and so I just decided to go for a will o wisp but instead of hitting Blue Chrome, I hit uh, Togekiss, which is kind of mean. But he goes for a, a Thunder Wave here, and I s switch into my um, my Black Chrome. Haha, <laughs> my Black Chrome is better. Haha, <laughs> I win. So he goes for a T Wave. He, he gets it off, and I decide to go for a bullet punch here, because I might as well just get some damage since I'm not that fast. But he, I get a pair of hacks. So he gets a fire blast. I'm taking fire blast from stronger guys, so I knew I was going to take this one. And so I do. And so I decided to go for another bullet punch. I'm like, okay, I can do another bullet punch. But he pair of hacks is me again. Which is stupid. So he takes out my bl my black chrome in two hits. So my poor black chrome didn't really do anything this battle. Mirror, mirror on you. Um, so I decided to go for my special defender here, my uh, Latius Puff. So I go for a T bolt here. I know he's gonna live because Togekiss are, at, are usually really bulky in special defense. So he goes for a thunder wave. He gets it off. And so he does what every single Togekiss does. He flinch axes me. And so he d goes for the air slash with a 60% chance. So I was kind of guessing that I would get a pair, I would get a flinch. And he does. He gets it off. And I was actually scared that he would actually roost, but he air slashes. And I pull through it and I get a T bolt off, which is really nice. And so his Togekiss goes down. Haha, <laughs> Skylar goes down. So he's out of his blue chrome again, and he actually gets a he does meteor mash, which I thought he would go for a bullet punch, but since he's faster because of the T wave, so I go into my Arcanine, I get a Will o Wisp off because I don't know what this guy is because he's he goes for a meteor mash again. I don't know if he realizes that steel is not very effective against fire, but I go for a fire blast after the burn and the healing and the. And actually takes his Metagross out. Out. I don't know if he was scarf because he didn't heal anything with leftovers. That that's just puzzled me. Anyways, he go he goes for his the I douse blacks. I don't know is that racist or something. But anyways, I go for a Will o Wisp, and even though it's super effective and the penguins are usually really good and special attack. I am amazingly bulky in special defense and defense and I take it like a beast. But I do something really stupid here. I actually switch out into my Skeptile. My Skeptile takes a surf pretty nicely, but then I do something really stupid again. I go for a substitute because I thought you would switch. Why would he switch? Because usually ones who carry surf have Ice Beam. Why am I so stupid? Anyways, he goes for the Ice Beam, breaks my sub, I'm like, oh crap, I might as well just get something off here. Leaf Blade won't do that much damage, so I'll just go for a Leech Seed. And so I Leech Seed him, which it does, it's going to be doing a lot of damage when I, when I get someone out. And so he takes my Blade Runner out and one Ice Beam, which is kind of me, remember me on you, but I send out my Gary 25. Every single time, Gary, in this battle, I want I do cl close combat. Something in the back of my head says, "Do you turn? Do you turn?" It would have one hit KO Ladius in one hit. Would have one hit Seller be in one hit. Anyways, I go for a close combat, and I realize I'm not going to take him out with two with two hits. It does a little less than half, so I go with my Arcanine for some Death Fodder. He goes for a Psychic, which takes my Arcanine out for in out in one hit, which is I don't really care at this point. I go into my Tagoro. I go for um, a Will O Wisp just to get some residual damage. Um, so I get the Will O Wisp off, 
and so I burn it. He is about one, about a little less than half. So I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna go for a shadow sneak. It's super effective, but I actually get a crit and take it out, which is pretty awesome, considering that he parahacks my my black crown. Merth, revenge. Anyways, he goes for his, his penguin again, his racist penguin again, and so I go for an earthquake after he stealth rocks, which does some pretty good damage. It brings him down down, down the red. And after after he heals and the burn damage effects, I'm actually going to use Shadow Sneak just to try to take it out. And it does. Shadow Sneak hits and kills. Thank you, Dugoro. I was actually very questioning him being in my team, and I'm so glad I put him in. Anyways, he goes for his Drachi, and I just go for a Will-O-Wisp, just, just in case it's like a scar for a physical Drachi. But he actually wishes. So, I know he's going to go for attack move at this point, and so I just go for a pain split, he actually does go for attack move, which is awesome. So he goes for a sidekick, I do pain split just to heal some damage off, and to do some damage back, but he actually whiffs, so it doesn't really matter about the damage. And after the burn, it does a little damage off, a little damage on him. And so I actually go for an earthquake here, after a psychic, which does a lot of damage. Holy crap. So, I go for Earthquake, which does decent, it does a little less than half, I mean, it, it puts him a little less than half, and I don't know why I did this, but I went for Earthquake again, I thought I would live this, but that was really stupid on my part, so I should have gone Shadow Sneak there, but whatever. I go to my Gary again. Just to finish this off, I know I'm fashioning this Drachi, and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna do a cool move I haven't done yet. Flare Blitz. So I Flare Blitz it, and I take it out. Even after the recoil, it doesn't really matter. Thank you, Gary, you won this game again. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for giving me 20 subs, guys. It, uh, hopefully, 50 next. Um, stay classy.